may not sound like the makings of a musical suite, but it is definitely music to the ears of these four San Francisco composers. Together, they've recorded the actual sounds of the Golden Gate Bridge, from cables to guardrails, all in the name of music. One, two, three, four! It's not as crazy as it seems. Back in the studio, these four men make up the San Francisco synthesizer ensemble. Scott Singer is the music director. John Lewis writes film scores. Paul De Benedictus specializes in computers and music. And the producer-composer Doug McKechnie came up with the whole idea. We didn't know what the bridge would sound like. And once we heard the sounds, we realized that it was an extraordinary device uh, to, uh, to create rhythms. And, uh, and uh, what, what we finally decided to do with ourselves as an ensemble is to, is to give a, a history, a musical history of the Golden Gate Bridge. Okay, this is cable number one. First, we capture the sounds onto tape, and then took those sounds and put them inside a computer, which allowed us to see the waveforms and manipulate them, and then, place, then we place them inside a sampler keyboard, which is a keyboard that actually takes live sound and then spreads that sound over a keyboard. Local companies from the Silicon Valley with names like Apple, Emu, and Opcode Systems created the technology to make this happen, something that couldn't be done 10 years ago. The sound of the cable itself and the other explosions it may sound like a laser beam, but it's actually the bridge. The big cable, giant sound. Once the sounds from the Golden Gate Bridge are recorded and digitized and computerized, they're then put into this sampler, which is a state-of-the-art synthesizer. And this is where the sounds come alive. To capture the essence of the Golden Gate, each of the four artists composed a piece of music to reflect the different phases of building the bridge, sort of a musical history in four movements. the opening piece and basically it's the Golden Gate without the bridge and in that sense it's really the sea. I actually thought it was going to be the most fun because I would get to use the most bridge sounds in, in, in the idea of the building of the Golden Gate Bridge. You have a lot of metal, you know, machines and, and people working. I was envisioning uh, the feeling of the time, the, the way people were dressing, how exciting it must have been, the sense of, of drama. The piece takes you into the day and must leave you with a very optimistic view into the future. Four men who have blended technology and music in honor of a bridge that has taken engineering and created a tradition of its own. In San Francisco, Kate Kelly, Channel 5, Eyewitness News. <laughs>